will be covering the installation process for the FiberTap Plus 4 port, 8 port, and 12 port options. The first step will be to prep your fiber optic cable for termination inside of the enclosure. Using the appropriate tools listed in the installation instructions, cut and peel back approximately 20 inches in total of the fiber jacketing, exposing the central strength members. Measure 2 inches from the fiber jacketing and trim both central strength members appropriately. Next, we will prep the enclosure by installing the central strength member clamp and rubber grommet fitting. Make sure the clamp is installed at the entry port side. Do not tighten the central strength member clamp all the way down to the base. Install the appropriate grommet to your cable type flush with the open end of the entry port. Ensure the grommet to be flush with the second half of the grommet. If your fiber is not currently connectorized, install the appropriate number of field installable connectors following Multilink's installation guide. If you're using pre-terminated fiber, feed each fiber connector through the base of the enclosure. Feed the fiber jacketing into the base while simultaneously sliding the central strength member under the clamp located inside the base. Carefully secure the strength members under the clamp and tighten it down. Next, we will apply a thin coat of grease around the entire grommet. This will help to ensure a tight seal. Install the second half of the grommet onto the base in an alternating pattern as shown. Make sure the entry lines up with the base and secure the provided zip tie around the enclosure's entry flange. Ensure the zip tie is tight enough to allow additional compression to complete the seal on the fiber jacketing. Check to make sure there are no visible holes. Everything should have a tight fitting. Locate the fiber management clip and place it into the enclosure with the zip tie in place. And secure the fiber tubes with the zip tie. Do not tighten the zip tie to the maximum as it will cause damage to the fiber tubes. Leave at least a one inch diameter, then cut the remaining tail. The top of the enclosure lid has a port layout diagram. Route each fiber to its corresponding port based off of the fiber color chart. Once each connector has been secured into place, it's time to close up the enclosure. Start by applying a thin coat of sealant around the gasket of the lid. And place it onto the base of the enclosure. Ensure the outmost surface of both the cover and the base are aligned before flipping the enclosure over safely. Next, locate the screw holes on the back side of the base and tightly fasten each screw into place in an alternating pattern as shown. Before installing the FiberTap Plus into the field, visually inspect to make sure the enclosure is sealed and can withstand the elements that may occur. Your FiberTap Plus installation is now complete. For any other installation instructions or product guides, please visit Multilink's website for additional information.